okay hello guys so this is the galaxy j6 plus and it's using the android 12.1 okay in this video i will make a quick review about rom is it good enough or not for the driver okay so we'll wait we'll check for the email the wi-fi the gps taking a picture record the video and also that's using the root viewer and septinet okay if you need a tutorial how to flash this rom you can check from my previous video okay so stay tuned and check it out Okay, hello guys assalamualaikum so this is the galaxy j6 plus and it's using the android 12.1 online H. okay so in this video i'm going to make a quick review just a quick about the basic function of the phone is is it quite usable or not for the lead driver okay maybe some of you guys want to know so we're going to review this ROM. And now the first thing you want to know usually you want to know if the email is safe or not. Okay, we can always check using the code. Star sharp zero six sharp. And there you go. So we have our email safe both the uh, email one and two so there is no problem and you can see right here also i'm using the wi-fi and also the sim card also working so there is no problem with the internet connection okay so you can see right here we're using the new ui display Okay, you can change the menu right here. There's a lot of menu you can use. Ambience display, the reading mode, and other stuff. Okay, you can customize it. You can arrange and customize your own. And let's go to the settings. Okay. This is the J60G, but you can use it on the other person, like in the F or the FN. Okay, let's go to the about phone right here. And okay, this is Android 12. The security patch is on the December 13, 2022. Okay. You can always enable the developer option by hit the build number five times right here. Go back, back again, go to the settings. Uh, where is it? <laughs> okay, let's go to hit the build number five times. Go back, go to settings, developer option, and it's always too good to change the animation so you will have better smooth experience okay i usually use the 0 0.5 so it will be more smooth you can see right here okay next thing let's check the gps let's open the map and i think the map is not very accurate okay but it's not a problem <laughs> can always use ways or other stuff okay let's test the camera i'm going to take a picture and okay uh, as you can see right here it doesn't have a backup or <laughs> 
so I will take a picture and also record a video using the back and the front camera okay I will skip this one and here we go now let's check the result I have take a picture and also record the video from the back and front camera okay this is the result from the back camera it's not very good because the lens is dirty and uh, it can uh, have a better result if the camera is is not dirty okay and now this is the result picture of the front camera uh, I have a long hair right now <laughs> and this is uh, the video from the back camera okay let's listen the result okay seems it has a low, low sound it's not very loud let's check the result from the front video okay so the result from recording a video the sound is very small uh, but as I said before a bug it's expected <laughs> at least you can try the latest Android one okay and what else let's open the ADA64 let's check the CPU can see right here it's still using the 32 bit okay the clock is from 960 to 1.4 gigahertz okay and now let's open the root beer we want to know the result uh hey <laughs> can see right here we don't have a root access but it read the test key and the dangerous props okay it's usually because it's not clean enough in the build prop but I think it's not a problem if you don't use it for important things like banking and other stuff okay now let's open the safety net and safety net also fail you can but you can uh, fix this one safety net the basic integrity cps profile and also the root beer using mages if you want to okay and what else let's check the cpu throttle i expected this is very low because it use a very old processor you can see it's just using it it just it has just uh, 29 the IPS very low if you compare to the your phone it's usually above 100 okay. Uh, okay, it's, it's not very it's not a problem if you just use it for uh, social media I think <laughs> okay uh, what else okay let's stop this one okay i think that's all <clears throat> sorry i have we have reviewed the uh, gps the camera and so let's play the youtube maybe some of you guys want to see the sound and video different different while we record it has a small voice but in this while recording a video we have a loud sound but while playback using the YouTube it has a large sound okay let's hear it again <laughs> Okay, nice. 
so what is the conclusion okay. it's not the best custom ROM you will get for this phone but at least you can try the latest Android one the latest one uh, I mean the Android 12.1 if you want to try the new a display and it's kind of smooth you can always use this phone to revive its android and use for social media okay that's all guys this is a review about the galaxy j6 plus using line edge custom rom on android 12.1 okay i hope it helps you take care stay safe and wassalamualaikum and i hope you like my video if you find it very useful please give it a thumb and i also have lots of video about routing custom rom and lots of fun okay especially xiaomi samsung realme asus and other stuff okay uh you can find in my video maybe some of the video will be useful for you okay guys if you subscribe it will make me excited to make a new video and that's all stay self stay safe stay health and wassalamualaikum